When you are in your own little world, you are like a frog that is on a well without water. Have you tried putting a frog in a well without water? Like about 10 feet deep or 20 feet deep. If you are that frog, what will you do? All you can do is just jump three inches from where you are and you go back down again. And all you have to do is just look up. When you look up, you see a hole, a, a, a round or a square hole above you. And that hole affords you to see the opening of the heaven above you. And you thought that that is all that heaven is about. The little hole, that is all the heaven I have. In the evening, I see that hole. It's lighted and I see stars around it. And you thought that is all that heaven is. Until you get out of that hole. Somebody will take you out of that hole. And then you see the panoramic view of the universe. It is unlimited. The limitless panorama of heaven will open before you. You in religion, you are all frogs. When you look up, all that your heaven is telling you is what your teachings told you in that religion. When you look up, you see the stars. Who are the stars? Your leaders. You Catholics, when you look up, what do you see? Ah, the leading star is the Pope. The Cardinals. And that is all that you see. You Protestants, when you look up, who do you see? The one that was taught to you. That is all the heaven that you see. And you thought that that is all that heaven is. Until you get up like me. When I was in denomination and religion, when I look up, I thought that this religious and denomination, heaven I have, is all the heaven that it, that, that is. Until the Father took me up and I saw the panorama of heaven. I saw the greatness of the power of God. I saw the universe. It's an it's limitless in its nature. It blew my mind. So I was lost in the greatness of the Father Almighty. And just imagine how He loves the human being. Just imagine heaven was open to me, and all of these revelations just came one by one.